blistering today. We're all feeling the heat in Central Texas. Those usual high temperatures appear to be here to stay. Tomorrow, we're going to be in a code orange air quality day. So if you're spending the day outside, what should you do? Omar Lewis has some answers. It's hot, but it's fun. Folks in Austin were pulling out all the stops to beat the heat with snow cones, the shade, and lots of water. With festival and lake goers doing everything possible to keep their mind off the scorching weather. We've got fans to kind of keep it comfortable, and um, and I think once you know a little shade in here, and and once everybody gets starts painting, they forget about the heat anyway. Drinking water, wearing hats, and lots of sunscreen. Some say they didn't mind the temperature. I love the heat. I love Austin. Austin. I love living here and I don't mind it when it's 100 degrees. The 5K race drew large crowds, decked out in their costumes, ready to keep Austin weird while the sun kept it hot. We're drinking lots of liquids, lots of sunscreen, staying in the shade, keeping it cool. We're fine. Town Lake was another popular spot as hundreds gathered to cool down, not letting the heat put a stop to the weekend fun. Um, we live in a great city to be outside, so even when it's warm out, as you can see, there's tons of people out actually getting some exercise. But as the sun bears down this weekend, it's a reminder of the triple-digit weather we saw last year, leaving people hoping this isn't a sign for more more hot weather to come. Now, if you survived last summer, then you pretty much, I think, uh, can, sur can survive anything. What do we have, like 60 days over 100? It was pretty brutal, but uh, hopefully the summer not quite so hot for so long. In Austin, Omar Lewis, KXAN News. Now, tomorrow's code orange air quality alert means that the elderly and folks with breathing issues should avoid being outdoors for a long period of time.